Sometimes we can't follow Jesus because we're too busy looking at our past. Sometimes we can't follow Jesus because we're so far ahead of him. Following Jesus is simply be right next to him. Then you'll always know where he's at. So be in that moment with him. Okay? When we stop following Jesus, and this is for all of us that have been in church for a long time, when you truly stop following Jesus and you're where he is at, unfortunately, sometimes what happens is we start becoming very critical, we start critiquing people, we start judging people, we start trying to maximize things. Like, why don't they do it like this? Well, I don't know, how come she like that? Well, doesn't she know that the word of God says this? Quote, unquote, Ann Lee Stanley says it like this, and I think it is powerful. Quote, unquote, Ann Lee Stanley says, the more conscious I am of the work God has yet to do in me, the less critical I am of what God has yet to do in you. Church, that's where we need to live. If you are constantly aware of the work that God's doing in you, you ain't got no business criticizing somebody else for the work that God still needs to do in them. Hallelujah. Okay? When we live like that, that's what makes church awesome. Because then anybody can come into the house of the Lord and answer the call to follow and be safe. Regardless of whether they're a believer, regardless if they have no faith, regardless if they're a sinner, regardless if they're stuck in an addiction, regardless if they're stuck in a wrong lifestyle, they should be able to come to church, be loved, and simply follow. At the dinner table, tonight with your family, one question would be worthy of wrestling and grappling with. Are we following?